Hello, and welcome to my unboxing of my new HD PVR. This is the Hopage, Hopage, or Hopage, Hopage, however you want to pronounce it. It's a French company, and we're going to unbox the HD PVR Gaming Edition. So we're going to take the flap up like this, and have a look at the first cable we pull out. It comes in nice plastic wrapping, and it's the component cable for your games console. This cable has connections for your Xbox 360, your Xbox, your PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, PlayStation 1, and even your Wii. The next cable is the power supply for the HD PVR unit, normal 5 volts. The next cable is a USB A to B, as a B type connector, you might call this a printer cable. And the last one is a huge component cable. This is component to component, just like that. Behind this piece of cardboard here is the actual HD PVR unit. So we're going to take it out, it's quite light, very lightweight, no hard drive on that, and I'll show you how to work in a later video. And after you do some more digging around inside the box, you can find the manuals. So here is the first one. It's every language in how to set up your HD PVR with a small picture representation. And then we have the second leaflet, which is a bigger picture representation of how to do it. And the last one is your software. This disc contains both the drivers and the recording software that you'll need to record from your PVR. So here it is, all set out. You've got your component cable, USB A to B, and we're gonna have a closer look at the component to your games console. You can see the PlayStation and Xbox there, and even the Wii one. It's ready to record off any games console. It converts it into the component format. Notice you've got two reds. One says audio and one says nothing. The one that says nothing clearly fits into the video port. As you can see, there's a component connection here. And click here for the setup video. And thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.